Welcome to the Enterprise Mobility for BMC SRM video. Today we'll be showing the features of BMC's service request management on a BlackBerry device. The SRM interface is designed to be lightweight and easy to use. You can see immediately that there are two simplified choices for SRM. The first is reviewing your current service requests in the system. You can see as we enter the user service request queue that any pending service requests are listed. We can drill into the service request and see if there are any pending status items or other conditions that describe the status of this request. The notion behind Enterprise Mobility for Service Request is that when updates to the pending service requests happen in Remedy, the information is synchronized in the background within Enterprise, so there's no need for the user to go to the desktop to see any activities associated with their service request. Next, we'll look at creating a service request at the BlackBerry. When we go to Create, we can see that we have two choices. One is to look through the available service catalog for this user. The other is to search the available service requests for this user. In our example, we'll enter the service request catalog. Once inside, we see that we have a table structure very similar to that within SRM at the desktop. When we choose a specific catalog item, we can see again that if there are sub items, these are now displayed. We will now choose a specific service request. The first thing we notice when we enter the service request is information about the service item, whether that relates to the cost of the item or the duration or any other factors that might be important. Next, we will drill into the service request. Within this request, you can see that the information needed to satisfy this request is available, and we can fill in these items with the BlackBerry. These fields are specific to this service request chosen, and if any happen to be default fields, they will be filled in automatically. We will process the record and choose a date of service as well. As I finish the instructions for the service request, I'll submit it back to the system. I've intentionally left one of the fields blank to show what happens with the error conditions in Remedy. You will notice here that we have triggered an error condition with this service request. Enterprise acts like another type of Remedy client, so if there's a specific workflow that needs to be completed, the Enterprise client will alert the user and allow them to correct any mistakes that they might have made. Once this record is correct, it can be entered into the Remedy system. It will be logged into the user service request queue, and as updates come from Remedy, they will be updated on the BlackBerry device. This ends the short video on Enterprise Mobility for BMC Service Request Management.